Changi video zeigt uns viel Lachqualen. Hallo und willkommen back to Learn Qualish. So, heute werden wir talk about the past tense. Ja. Yeah. To do past tense in Qualish, you just put the word ruoa, ruoa, ruoa in front of the words to past tenseize it. For example, walk toch would be ruoa toch walked. Ruoa toch. Ruoa toch. Past tense is used to say something about something that happened in the past. For example, I walked here. Toi ruoa toch tjach. Pronunciation. In Qualish, you can pronounce the X as ch, but also as the English X. X. Mostly, you would pronounce it as ch, and you should only use it as x if it would cause confusion otherwise. However, mostly we just say ch, like in chong. Here's some simple vocabulary. Chong, meaning house, we already learned this. Toch, means walk. Ketoi, kegoi, kenoi, etc. means something I said in episode 1. is basically just uh, possessive pronouns. And ketai means every day. And vilach means language. Using possessive pronouns. In Qualish, possessive pronouns come after the word it is possessive to. For example, chunk toy means my house, literally meaning house my. Chunk toy, my house. Toy was chunk toy, I study at my house. Yok toy, my dog. Negative. With negative, I mean things like not, no, don't, etc. So here they are. Ong equals do not, will not, have not, depending on the context. Kyong is not, Hong is no. Ong, Kyong, Hong. Ong, Kyong, Kyong, Hong. As you can see, Qualish is highly context based. Now we are at the final thing. Example sentences. Chunk toy is in land along, which means my house is in the Netherlands. House my is in the Netherlands. Land along is Netherlands, which has two words like in English, but land means country, and long is just the name of the Netherlands. Like Villaglan, Villaglan is Dutch, which means Villaglan, the language of the Netherlands. So you just put Lan after everything about the country, yeah. So, country, I don't know how you pronounce that, but I don't care. Chong Chong, Chion Chong as the Chong Trong Chong. Oh my god. Chon Chion Chong is the Chong Trong Tom. This house is the house of Tom. So there's nothing special about this sentence, I think. Yeah. So thank you for watching this episode of Learn Qualish. I hope you enjoyed it.